Hello gaming fans and welcome to Band of Brothers 3 and this is my review of the uh, forthcoming game that I'm sure you all looking forward to from reading some of the comments been left by my German colleague who's reviewed the game himself and what he thinks of it. Well, all I'm going to say is what a bag of poo this game is. <laughs> yes, I'm afraid um, the game is really not going to be all you hope for, I'm afraid, uh, gaming fans. Um, I've played this for a few days now and I am not impressed with this at all. Um, that's that's the bottom line of it. It is a, such a shame, really. Now, I'm gonna, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to play a level um, and to show you how it plays out, okay? And um, maybe you can see before I explain to you why I don't like this game, uh, the issues with it. So, okay, we're going to play a game. We do a campaign here, and I need to change my weapon and go play. I think that's the one, is it? Or was it? Yes, let's go that one. Okay, play and go play. You okay. I believe this is the one. Yes, this is the one that I do. Okay. Now watch out for some numerous errors, especially when the guy starts to read towards the soldier to slit his throat. You notice something about what he's carrying. Yes, watch this. Okay, notice he's carrying nothing, so that should be a weapon there. Well, there goes guy's dead. Okay, so, right on towards the game. Now, press a moment. Uh, if I just do hit the hit him and shoot him, boom, there it goes. And already I get shot at. And uh, as you can see, I got a knife down for cover. Try my to cover and then take him out. And watch just how many bullets I'm using against him to take him out. Yes, there we go. Reload. And look, he's still going. There we go. And that's fine. I got him. Okay, so now I've got to take out these guys. And he's in the way, so I can't see what's going on. He's killed him for me. Excellent. Okay, and ah, oh, dear. We shot him again, and I got to find some more cover because I can't get at him. So let's run towards him. Take cover, and fire, and fire again, and fire again, and fire again. Oh, I got, and fire, and that was just, okay, that's one down. Oh, still alive, there he goes. Keep him off. If I get, let's use my brother, take him out. Come on. He's killed, oh, he's killed him, good. That's killed him, excellent. Right, there we go. Okay, now, as I said before, notice, right, this game operates on the old, this is, say, uh, you get to a point of, and whoops, Mr. Mind there, and every minute you see them, Get to here, and uh, straight away we're gonna have bad guys. And here they come. There we go. Okay, so take them out, get them out of cover, and then get out. See, reload. Take them out again. You can see, ah, get them reload again, and take them out again. Oh, got a headshot out of that as well. Okay, and reload. Okay, and fire there, and again, and again, and again, and again. There we go. Oh, no, still killed him. And I go. There we go, there we go. I've got to take him out because he fires an SMG and you can see us. Oh shit, he's going to hit me now with an SMG. Buff! Jesus Christ, and try again. And again. And again. And days down, yes! No, he's not! He's still alive. And, oh god, he's hit me again. And I think we've got him this time. Right, use my dude. And take, use my heavy machine gun dude, take him out. There we go. Now I'm bleeding to death here, so I've got to find cover quickly. And take up, let find some cover. So I can, I can heal all myself. That's cover, apparently. Yes, that's cover. So I'm bleeding to death here, and I need to. There we go. Sort of healing myself behind, behind this cover. Okay, right. Shall we push on? Let me wait for my dude to uh, heal. Himself. Let me look for my dude first. My brother, or dude as I call him, he is a special ability, and that's a slowdown that I have to wait for before I can use him again. And he's heavy weaponry, so. Okay, onwards we go. Da -da 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 -da. Okay. Over the top. Once again, and then uh, trigger off the next guy. Got to kill him quick before he sh fires his bazooka. And there we go. Nope, let's don't kill him. And nope, and he's just fired off the bazooka. And we can bleed it to death. Okay, now time for a cutscene again. As you can see there, it's all really well done. Yes, really well done here, of course. Nice cutscene. And okay. <coughs> I'm still bleeding to death here, so I've got to find cover quickly before I die. So behind here. Now notice you got two chaps right next to each other, and they can't hit these two guys. 
That's very good. You show me? There's two of them right next to uh, look, they're literally next door to each other and they can't hit each other. And I'm and I'm bleeding here. They're firing at me instead. This is like Hello? There's two guys there. I mean there's one there's two of them there and they're firing at me. I mean they're literally just across the street from each other. And even there's a guy over there behind the and it's like, hello? You know, take the guys out next door to you for God's sake. I'm like hello Gah. So it's more shooting. And that's yay, there we go, another cutscene. Okay. Here we go again. So this is where I cut scene. And at this point it gets stupid. Okay, now Nate the guy behind there. Not him, the guy to the left. He's got a machine gun post. Alright? Now I've got nothing to take him out with. I need bazookas and I have to buy them. So I have to quickly go, yay! Shoot him out and quickly take the guy out if I can before he fires at me. And he's gonna fire because I've got nothing left and shit. And I'm dead. And no, I'm not gonna do that. Okay, and back to no. Oh, and yes, I need. Do you wish to buy more consumables? No, I don't. Later, please. Okay, and that is a level of abandonable with three. Now, I can imagine you going there. What the fuck was that all about? Excuse my language. Well, that is my point. Um. I really, really cannot understand what they were thinking with this game. I mean, as you saw me there, I was entering full clips into guys that had no cover and standing still like they weren't being, like they were standing still. And it seemed amazing. The only way to kill them was with headshots, okay? That's one thing you have to And now the game recommends that you find cover. Great, but even though when you behind cover, you're still getting shot at by enemy. Is even if you're behind a box or rock. Uh, used to get shot at by the enemy. That's nothing. As you see there, once again, the game operates on the old point system of which you get to point A, then release troops, etc. So it's not the game is very linear to say the least. Okay. Um, we do have uh, extra like events, commando, and top secret where you can earn extra XP and. Uh, um, XP and dog tags. These dog tags allow you to make purchases and upgrades for your weapons. Um, so, for example, here, if I want to upgrade my uh, Sten, I can use 150 uh, dog tag points to upgrade my clip size. So I can go reload. So go yes, and it's four seconds. Where some would take you two hours. Two hours. Uh, no, so it'd be two minutes. So not two hours. Two minutes. Two minutes. And I've seen one that takes you nearly an hour for an upgrade to happen. So yes. You have to wait. Also, now if you want to speak items such as maybe you need to, you need to want items such as consumables. For example, you might need some medkits. You have to pay for them. Grenades, very handy. You have to pay for them. Uh, the bazooka, which I could do with, uh, probably in that mission, you have to pay for them. So yes, any of the extra ones you add to the consumables, you have to pay for them by using your premium gold stars. And so, if I wanted to do, uh, bundle us, so if I want to, so example, uh, 60 gold stars. Uh, no, I don't want to do that. So, say, if I want to bundle 60, 50, 20. So, if I want to add gold stars, you see there, £2.59, 6 49 12 99 24 24 99 and 124.99 for 5,000 gold stars. Now, I'm afraid this is absolutely not on. Okay, I am I agree with free to play that if you want to support the developer, then you chuck at what you want to spend. But not when the game insists that you have to spend consumables to do the levels. That is simply not right at all. You should be able to do the levels without having to spend expendable. You should be able to do a level without having to make purchases for items. Now, as you see there, that uh, um, machine gun turret. Now, the only thing I've got, I think, can use is the bazooka on it. Uh, I've got, and without that, I need to spend. Sorry, I need without that. Uh, I need to spend uh, at least five. Uh, five. I need to spend at least uh, five or f ten gold stars to put to ten, to, to ten gold stars. So that means I need to. Uh, spend at least two pound fifty nine dollars uh, to expend to buy some expendable items. 
So you can maybe say, oh, okay, <coughs> excuse me, that's the price of game. So maybe you can say that's fair enough. But I still do not, do not agree on that you have to um, use money to buy items, which you will need to do in missions. There is another one that I was uh, playing earlier, where you have to take out a tank. And guess what's the best way to take out a tank? Bazookas. And once again, you've got any bazooka bullets, you have to buy them, as far as I'm aware of. I have not seen anywhere where you can earn gold stars. It is all down to uh, dog tags. You can uh, find crates among the levels if you look for them, but there's no guarantee we get for them. So once again, I was doing this level where I said I need a bazooka to take out a tank, and I was getting with grenades, which is no good. As the game says, you need bazookas to take out tanks. Great. So, like I say, um, there is no multiplayer from what I gather, but there is a strange thing where if you do die um, in the game, in the do down level, then when you come back, you're told about the guy who killed you is actually on the map. If you actually shoot him, you get uh, like revenge points to go towards your experience points. So maybe in future there's going to be um, some kind of uh, multiplayer. But I wouldn't really want to try and play it on multiplayer. Um, I find on the iPad 2 Air, when I want to scroll around in a hurry, I have to literally repeatedly use my finger to actually move 360 degrees. Yes, it's that slow at turning, even on an iPad 2. I have to literally do repeatable movements on my finger to scroll the game around. Uh, especially when I'm in attack from behind. When I'm doing some of the rain missions, I have to defend my position. Um, so, as I say, I really, really don't like this game, I'm afraid. It is such a shame. Um, it is going to be such a sh Well, it's been spoilt. Um, I don't know. I really can't... I've got no words for it. I mean, you may, you maybe enjoy it, maybe you spend the money on it, um, and maybe you get the fun out of it. You will do, but um, for me personally, as I say, don't like the game. Uh, it it could be done a lot better than what it is. Um, you seen level yourself what I had to go on. Um, I'm not going to waste my time uh, trying to justify the good things about it because it isn't worth it. Um, well, like I say, at least it's free to download, so you're not going to waste your money. But I would extremely uh, air caution on buying uh, items towards the game because if they have errors like this in the game where you, well, like I say, I'm afraid I'm not a game I would recommend to. It's not a game I would recommend uh, to play. You can download it for free when it comes out uh, sometime in the near future. But in my opinion, now yeah, sorry, this is a wasted opportunity. And isn't worth my time. So once again, thank you for listening. Oh, and by the way, if you want to get in touch with me now, you can do. Uh, my name is um, Brian at touchplay.com. Uh, That's Brian at touchplay.com. Uh, I will leave my email address at the bottom of the video. So if you want to make any comments, ask about any questions about this game or any other future reviews that I will be doing, then please do drop me a line. I'd like to hear from you. I do read all my emails, so uh, and I will try to reply to you as soon as I can if you've got a question. So once again, thank you for listening, and I will see you again soon. Goodbye for now.